What up? Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. It's your boy Jess. Welcome back to A2Z. And today we are uh, on the Dallas Cowboys, man. And right now I was actually confused because I always have Dallas defense and I have to manually change the offense. And I forgot Dallas is going to be on Dallas on both. So I was like, oh, snap. I don't have to change a thing. Yeah. <laughs> so here we go, man. Uh, trying to see if we can go on ahead and uh get get stinky with these dallas cowboys you know it's crazy the monday night game actually fell asleep um or no sunday night excuse me as we end up getting i didn't mean to spin right there man just a bad well i mean i meant to spin but a uh, horrible horrible decision by me to spin right there um i fell asleep uh and i woke up i was like dozed off and i look at romo look at romo taking off so i fell asleep and i woke up sometime around the last drive that the giants had and I didn't even see them kick the field goal, but I seen that the that the uh, Cowboys had a 15 yard penalty, and it, it was a first down. It was uh, like close to the two minute warning or under. I'm not sure exactly where it was, and uh, I ended up falling asleep. I, I fell back asleep. I wake up and the Cowboys won. I'm like, what? How the heck did that happen? Then I saw the highlights. And I'm like, wow. Uh, I definitely feel like uh, none against you Giants fans. I know. I know there's gonna be some people, you know. Telling me how Kaepernick is a bum because I'm gonna say something about their guy Eli, but uh, well, not even nothing negative about uh, Eli. But I think you guys should would know agree that uh, Eli cost you guys that game just by one mistake. Apparently, he had told I guess Jennings could have scored on a play, but he told him not to, something. I don't know. I, like, again, I I slept during the game. I missed it. Um, I, I seen bits and parts of it, but not really the entire thing. Um, but on the third down. If he takes a sack, if he just takes a knee, with Dallas having no timeouts, they go on ahead and uh, run off an extra 40 seconds before that field goal, giving them less than a minute to be able to retaliate and score that game-winning drive. So, and Eli is the, you know, he's a multi-Super Bowl winning quarterback. You know, he's uh, he's a, he's a very look at Dez though. He's he's a very very he's a very good quarterback at times. You know, uh, he's not. He's not very consistent, but put that boy in a postseason, and, and that's where the consistency matters the most, right? He, he can prove he, he can get it done. Um, but uh, he should know. He should know that he needs to, to, you know, take a sack right there or take a knee. Just get down. Do not throw the ball away, which saved them, the Cowboys, 40 seconds. And, you know, right there. Wow. Des dropped it, though. Wide open. Wide open. He just dropped it. Like, how do you drop? He was wide open on the corner route, on the post. And the man just dropped it. And I'm like, you got to be kidding me. I'm like, come on, son. How are you going to sit there and just flat out drop that pass that was blatantly thrown? Wow, Des. Des out here dropping passes, man. So, uh, we're up 10-0. We got ourselves a good lead. And hopefully, we can just keep it going. Uh, right here, he rolls out with Peyton Manning. He's looking. He's looking. He goes deep up top. And somehow gets a hand on it and snags it and i'm like wow wow really that's that's how we getting down right now that's that's how we roll right here he decides to roll out again he's doing a lot of rolling out with Payton. He goes over there towards the that's my fault i didn't think he was gonna throw it there uh once uh the receiver kind of left my screen area and i couldn't see over there anymore as we get a beautiful pick though i couldn't see over there anymore i decided to cut back towards the middle i figured he's not gonna throw he can't even see him but he threw the ball anyways just as i was cutting back Right here, we end up getting a, a nice throw to uh, Cole Beasley. And this game, you're going to see Romo be absolutely disgustingly horrible. Like, look at that. Look how bad he overthrew that. Something about this game with overthrows is this right there is completely my fault. I should have went underneath. You know, he's playing a lot of cover three. So, um, right here, I just figured, you know, let me try to check it up to Dez. But I'll settle for a field goal. Um, Romo missed so many throws. I don't know what is going on. Carson Palmer did it to me. And now it's going to be Roma, as you're going to see in the second half, where it really matters the most. I cannot complete a pass, and it's so frustrating on how horrible they make. Now, I understand, uh, you know, last year, that's a gorgeous interception. Last year, you know, anybody can roll outside the pocket, throw off their back foot. They could throw a fadeaway, and it'll be on the money. This year, you know, it's way different. But if I'm flat-footed, standing in the pocket, making a 15- to 20-yard throw, 
you know, nine ninety percent of the time, ninety five percent of the time, I should be able to snag. The, I mean, as I snag that, I should be able to throw accurately, no problem. Especially with a top tier quarterback like Romo. And I know you guys are gonna be hating like top tier. He's a top tier quarterback. Don't hate on the guy. Right there was my fault, man. Um, I put Jason Wayne on a streak, and I I felt like he was gonna be open on the inside, which he was, but he got bumped. Just look how wide open he is. Good read by him. Um, just as I threw it, Jason Witten got bumped a little bit off his route and he got stuck in the animation where I couldn't even attempt to go for the ball. So now it's a one possession game. Now I'm like, okay, well, our offense really isn't doing that well. We got to get something going here. So we go back to the run right here. Try to get some time going. Uh, I need some momentum, momentum. We need some momentum right here. Look at this throw Beasley wide open, overthrown wide open. I know he's calling cover three. So we're Z spotting him again, wide open towards the sideline. Overthrow like what the hell kind of throws are they giving me back-to-back -back corner? What open like open he's calling cover three, you know, I, I have a uh, I have the flats being occupied I have the deep blue being occupied which leaving the sideline wide open I'm making the right play call against this cover three and Romo is just flat-out missing the throw horribly uh, Good throw right there uh, You know ends up picking up a huge first down on 30 and 20 right there just a, a little bit behind and i'm getting a little nervous ah i was like almost there and ah bad usering by me uh now i'm getting a little nervous he's gonna go ahead and come back i'm getting a little nervous i'm not gonna lie so he decides to roll out right here second and 19 and uh, he just throws it over there. and thankfully we made a very good play right there i'm batting that down third and 19 right here he goes for his trusty 04 verticals he's been calling that play a lot on his go to uh go to long uh plays and uh Thankfully, we end up uh, picking that off. So all we need to do is just get in field goal range. Just get in field goal range, go up two possessions, go from there. Uh, try to run the ball right here, man. Again, try to kill some clock and get some momentum going. We go back to the run, and that block shed completely obliterated that run. Forcing me on third and nine right here. Again, corner route, just badly overthrown out of bounds. Just horribly overthrown out of bounds. I don't know what it is about Romo throwing towards the sideline, but he, he's missed easy four or five throws right there was my fault i went for the hit stick i should have went for the short tackle and uh thankfully thankfully we ended up catching up to him so uh we still have an opportunity to go ahead and hold him to a field goal right here another interception so that right there makes wilcox's effort even more you know hugely huge uh right here we're reroute we go to the backfield right here and it looks like he good go oh yeah Hey, as we end up scoring right there and we end up going up multiple possessions and that right there was definitely a huge huge score for us to go on ahead uh we go for two unfortunately we are unable to get the pass off but we are up 19 to 7 with less than five minutes remaining and that is the one good thing about uh online head-to-head -head is that the time you know six minutes he has plenty of time you know six minute quarters you have plenty of time to try and come back and and uh, get yourself back in a ball game if uh you happen to be down Second and 10, he's roll out to the right, what he's been doing a lot, but we end up getting to him. I hate that right there. Like this year, they'll be on their way down and they'll pass the ball just as they're going down. I'm like, really? Like, come on, man, that's a sack. Uh, right there, we like that kind of happened to me. Like, you know, I passed, like that should be a sack. Right there, man to man, and that's my fault. I am trying to force feed Des Bryant. I'm trying to get him a touchdown so bad. I don't know why. I just want him to throw up the X. And uh, instead of just running the ball, you know, chewing some clock and kicking a field goal, I go on ahead and do a bonehead move, and I am trying to get Des Bryant the ball. Didn't work out. So hopefully we can go on ahead and just get in field goal range right here. We need to at least get in field goal range right here. Very important that we do so. Uh, running the ball right. Get out the way. Get out the way, man. I'm scared to throw the ball. I am. You know, right here, we just roll out with Tony Romo. And uh, get my, move out the way, man. <laughs> Third and eight right here. We're looking, we're looking, we're looking. And horrible pass by me. Man to man. And me being hard-headed, you know, Tony Romo's missed five throws on the sidelines. What do I do? I throw towards the sideline. What the hell's wrong with me? I don't know. Don't judge me. Third and 19 right here. He lobs it up. And we snag an interception. Less than two minutes. Uh, he has uh, two timeouts remaining. Well, not one. See if we can go ahead and just pick up a first down and end this game right here. 
We end up double juking and we get stopped shy of the first down. He calls his last time out. We could really use the first down right here. We go underneath quick drag the Williams and we end up picking up the first sealing the victory. So that's the end of the game, fellas. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Dez dropped it. Eli should have took a sack. Romo cannot throw towards the sideline. Jess is the Puerto Rican land lover. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed, man. I love each and every single one of you guys. See you guys next video. Peace.